All right, what's up guys? Today we got a Supreme Fall Winter 2018 pickup review video of the most hyped item every single year from Supreme. This of course is the box logo crew neck this year. So let's get right into the video and check it out. All right guys, last week, fall winter 2018 was this week 16. They released the box logo this season. Of course they did a crew neck. The past two seasons they did a hoodie, and the, I was correct in my last video, in 2015 they did another crew neck. I forgot they did the crew neck in 2015, they did like the camo one. Every year they kind of just do the same colors and they'll add like a couple different ones and like a weird pattern like a American flag hoodie and they'll have like a camo or they kind of went like super like 90s with like the orange and the red purple box logo. So they pretty much just do that every single season. This season of course we got the crew necks again. Um, I have a box logo hoodie from 2015, it's the tonal one. It's all black, the box logo is all black. I think it's cool, it's a little bit different. So I really wanted to get a crew neck, much like every single other person that buys Supreme, and people that don't buy Supreme, everyone went for it. So I'm glad to get the crew neck. I wanted something different from Supreme. So I'll just show you guys, I'll pull it up right now, but I'm gonna give you guys just kind of like a review on fit kind of video, detailed picks, and just my experience buying it, and is it worth it? Of course, I got black as always, black. You know, I just think black looks the best. I always go for black and everything. I went for a small time. I like try to get like white or gray and I'm just like, just buy what you like. I like black, so I have tons of black shit. So, but first up, the whole release date. I was on my phone and you know, I was just prepping. I was waiting. I was looking at like the, the clock to kind of refresh it right around like uh, 11, 10, 59, with 50 seconds. Refreshing from there. I had my, I was going off the browser, my Safari browser. I was refreshing the sweatshirt page and I copied my credit card number and autofill filled in the rest to Supreme's browser autofill filled in the rest. Then you have to enter in your month and the three digit number on the back of your credit card. So that was in my head, I was practicing. I knew where everything to press, the times to wait. Black came up. I was originally gonna go for four screen, but black was like the first one I came up where I clicked on. So I was like, you know what, fuck, go for black. You want black. Switch to medium, hit add to cart, paste in my, comp, uh, paste in my credit card. Went to the month, did that, waited for it, hit the three digit number, hit it. Wait, I, I wait like two seconds before I click add to cart, hit add to cart, and then the CAPTCHA was super easy. It was like the easiest CAPTCHA ever. It was like meant to be. Um, it was just like, pick the, the scores with cars. And it was just like the first four on the bottom was just like a row of like traffic or something. So it was like, boom, 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 hit it. And it was processing for a long time, but it eventually loaded and said, you got it. I was in like, uh, I was in a Walmart on my phone while I did it too, so I was like checking, I was like doing speed tests all around the Walmart, I was like trying to find, figure out the best spot to do it, I found like the best spot. I was like super like on my game for this, so I'm super happy to get it. It shipped, it was like the ship, the quickest thing ever too from Supreme that I got. I got it on Monday. I ordered it Thursday at like 11 o'clock, got it on Monday, never got anything on Monday. Tuesday sometimes, Wednesday, yeah, but never Monday, so super happy to do this. So let's get right into the details and everything about the box logo. Haven't even opened it up yet, but I definitely am gonna wear it. This was 158 retail, release date 12-6, fall winter 2018 season. This of course is the black one. And um, I got two box logo stickers with it. I don't even know where they came or anything like that, but that's what I got with it. <sighs> All right, here it is. First time kind of checking it out. I really haven't even looked at it. I had it in like the bag, just waiting to do this video. I've not even looked at it, so let me just check it out right now. I haven't even tried it on yet. All right, it's kind of like, it's like kind of surreal for me to see something like this. You know, you see some stuff like this online forever, and then when you finally get one, it's kind of like crazy that you're actually seeing it. So of course, at heavyweight cotton, just it feels just like all their other like heavyweight cotton hoodies and box logo hoodies before that. Black box logo embroidered on the front. You got the Supreme tags right here, made in Canada. Does it have like the, oh, and the medium's on the opposite side of the Supreme tag. On the back, of course, nothing. It's cuffed on the arms and it's cuffed on the bottom, so you got a clean look. And that's pretty much the hoodie right there. Definitely a lot of hype with these hoodies every season. People that don't even want Supreme want the hoodies. People just from all over, like, even, you know, you know how big Supreme is and people still are like, will comment, when do box look hoodies release or what, what time do they release? So. Every single year, just getting more and more hyped. I figure, just like looking at numbers and stuff from like, you know, Supreme Community, I feel like there's at least four times as many people as there is for a very high, like say like 
A North Face, I think for this drop, there's probably four times as many people for something like that. Maybe not North Face four times as much, but like something super hyped. I think there's four times as many people going for a box though, so it's super hard to get. Um, a lot of people actually uh, seemed they, they were going for green. Uh, that was my original thought to go for green or navy, and green sold out pretty quick, I think before black. Um, I think black is the most popular on StockX. Black is the most sold. And speaking of stock X and stock X and resale, I really don't go over resale or anything like that, but it's kind of interesting with box logos because when they first dropped 158 retail and they were selling for, I'd say like in that the high was like 790 that first week. I saw it at 790, maybe it went above eight, and then it kind of dropped. It was going down and down like the pat like the three days after it kind of was going down and down and down. Here we are, um, what is this, a week or two weeks, 12.6, what is it now? Uh, like eight days later, and it's now at $580. So it went from seven, I'd say 750 pretty good the first week, to like 580 now. And that's pretty. That's a pretty crazy drop off. If you can get a box logo for 550 or below, I would say buy it. 550 or below shipped, I'd say buy it. Don't hesitate, get it. I don't think you're ever going to see box logos like that cheap really again. If you're selling one, you know, usually it's like fuck the resellers, but some of you guys that get them and you're like, no, it's, I can make that much money, I'll just sell it and buy some other shit. Don't, I would not sell it within the next like week or two. I would wait a month at least until you sell this and they go up to like that $700 range again because they're going to go up with everything. The North Face, you buy it, it's pretty high for the first week, second week it drops down a lot and now like a month later you see shit that was like way more expensive because a lot of people buy it because they want it now so it goes up it might take a little bit more time in a month to sell but you definitely i think in a month it'll be back up around 750 at least and then years to come it will go up you know around that 850 area i think so definitely if you're gonna resell it i'd say wait a month if you want to buy it i think now is the time to buy it especially if it gets to 550 i'd go for it definitely a cool piece definitely a stable piece for the collection it's one of the few things i didn't have that i really wanted for the collection a box logo hoodie i wanted a box logo crew neck I want an S logo hoodie, I got that. You want an S logo hat, you want a classic logo hat, you want a box logo, like New Air and stuff like that. So it's kind of like those staple pieces you want to have for your collection. So super happy to get this. Definitely worth 158, of course. And if you're gonna buy one, I, I would say, if you can get it for 550, go for it. I appreciate you guys watching the video as always. Next Tuesday will be my drop list video or another collab video, I doubt there's another collab. And then Friday will be my pickups or random videos. I'll probably do like a top five like pickups from this season next Friday because I did pick up one thing from this drop, which was the Marvin Gaye late collaboration and they had the bike and the Luden stuff and the winter tees. I picked up one thing from that drop and I'll probably just do like a, you know what? I'll probably do like a top five with that view or the week after like a top five pickups from the whole season. So that's pretty much how the setup is. Tuesdays, I'll do like the drop list video Fridays is a random video or a pickup video from the week before. Appreciate you guys watching as always. I'm selling a lot of stuff in my story. Um, I'm just trying to get more money for the holidays and the move. I'm just trying to lessen all the clothes and stuff I have to move with me or just shit I don't wear. And I'd rather have a hundred bucks and a pair of shoes, you know? So I usually price my shit like I'll go on eBay or StockX or Grailed and I'll usually price it like at least 10% below what it goes for because I'm realistic. So on my story, I'll have a lot of shoes that are pretty cheap. I have a few shirts and I'm selling my gold bar necklace for like 325 shipped gifted. So if you want to buy some stuff, go on my story and you know, shoot me an offer. If you don't like the prices, we can work with it or we can not. So go buy my stuff so I can have more money for the holidays. Appreciate it. Mike.Kilroy is my Instagram. And stay tuned for my next video on Tuesday. And I hopefully you guys, you got some box logos. I know a few more people that I follow actually were lucky this season. So I'm happy to see the people that, you know, support the channel were a little bit more lucky than usual. Usually everyone's like, I fucking failed. You know, a lot of people actually said they got stuff. They got black or the gray. So I'm happy for you guys that got a box logo. If you didn't, maybe sell some shit and get it for like $550, $500. I think that's a good price. So appreciate you guys watching the video. Let me know what you thought of the video. Follow me on Instagram and buy some of my stuff, please. Except for you to say drop coming end of January. I appreciate it. It's going to be the best drop ever. I really like that it's more, like our first drop was kind of dark and like gritty, kind of like, like 70s kind of vibe, some of the photos and stuff like that. And then the next drop was like this, was more illustrated and kind of comic-y. So this third drop I think is like a mixture of both because I kind of want to get back to more of a darker vibe. So I think it's a mixture of both. I think it's really cool. It probably will be the most well-rounded drop since we've done it out of, you know, two. So stay tuned for that. Cypher like USA end of January for sure. And I appreciate you guys watching as always. And I'll see you in the next video.